Hi, Sarah Brooks here, Norwax Independent Consultant, and I just wanted to share why I decided to start using Norwax and then eventually transitioning into sharing the mission. You see, in January of 2019, my son started getting this rash on the back of his hands. Um, we did not know what it was from. At first, I thought it was eczema, you know, cold weather, dry air, um, but unfortunately, it was getting worse. Lotions or aquifer was not helping. So, in fact, it was getting worse. So, we decided it must be an allergy. So, we tossed out all this homemade uh, Play-Doh that I made, all this homemade sensory item stuff like colored rice, all this kind of stuff. I thought something must have gotten into it, so we tossed it, um, but it didn't help. So we went to the doctor, and the doctor didn't know what it was, but we were prescribed some treatments, steroid cream, and nothing seemed to help. By this time, a few months passed, and we were getting woken up in the middle of the night because my son was just complaining about how his hands hurt. During this time, I had went and heard of Norwax, of Norwax and sat through a presentation and I was blown away and I had started using it in my home. Well, about, a, uh, I'm sorry, about a month after the presentation, I went to his school for a teacher conference. And one of the things that the teachers raved about my son was that he had a helping heart. He loved to help. So his job was to clean the desks before and after snack. They also had um, the flu go around in the classroom. So all of the kids were pitching in and help cleaning the toys. So remembering that Norex presentation that I just went to, um, I asked the teacher, what are you using? And she pulled out the um, disinfecting wipe, the name brand disinfectant wipe. And I asked her, is he using gloves? Are these kids using gloves? They were not using gloves. Out of his class of nine, there was four kids that had some level of chemical burn. Isn't that crazy? Um, and, and of course that teacher didn't know, right? I never knew just a month before. I never looked at the back of my bottles. Like who does that? <laughs> who does that? And I was using it just like her. I was wiping it down, tossing away. I wasn't letting it sit. Um, for it to properly disinfect, and I definitely wasn't rinsing with water. And this teacher just didn't know, just like me. And I realized that this is, um, that I wasn't the only one not reading these things or even using them properly. So that's when I realized I wanted to educate. I want to educate um, people on, one, the proper use of using these disinfectant sprays and wipes. Like, in fact, you are supposed to let any of these sprays or wipes sit on the surface for at least four minutes, sometimes up to 10 minutes for it to properly disinfect. If it comes in um, contact with food, you need to wash and rinse the area very well with potable water. And there is a disclaimer on the back of every single one of those bottles that it says hazardous to humans and domestic animals. This is really alarming. And this is why I wanted to share. So over this course of year, we have my family personally, I have struggled with some health issues. They have improved immensely. We no longer have any mysterious rashes. We also um, had a lot of seasonal allergies. I would have to say that our seasonal allergies are like completely gone. Um, I have come into contact with people who they have realized that themselves or a loved one had some level of chemical burn. They realized their cracked skin was not just dry skin or overwashing, but in fact it was disinfectant wipes that they were using. Um, I have been able to get some of these wipes out of the classrooms, which is like a huge, huge win. Um, and there has been countless testimonies of rashes going away, um, skin conditions going away. Um, people's allergies or asthma diminishing. And it's just been an incredible journey. And I am just so thankful that you are here and experiencing the Norwex mission and you're going to hear a lot more about it. So thank you for letting me be a part of this and I cannot wait for you to share more.